Hello Legal Hustlers. In this video, we explore the key provisions of the Indian High Courts Act of 1861, including its objectives, structure, and impact on the Indian legal system. The Indian High Courts Act of 1861, passed by the UK Parliament, empowered the Crown to form High Courts in India. Queen Victoria, in 1862, created High Courts in Calcutta, Madras, and Bombay via letters patent. This legislative step, post the 1857 War of Independence, aimed to unify legal systems. The Act combined the Supreme and Southern Courts, authorizing the Queen to issue letters patent for High Court establishment. It didn't directly establish these courts but paved the way for their creation, transferring powers from Supreme Courts and Southern Adalits. Features of the Act In 1862, charters were granted for High Courts in Calcutta, Madras, and Bombay. Calcutta High Court, inaugurated on July 1, 1862, was the first, with Sir Barnes Peacock as its Chief Justice. Bombay High Court followed on August 14, 1862. The Act also enabled the establishment of additional High Courts, like the one in Agra, 1866, later moved to Allahabad. The Indian High Courts Act of 1861 laid the groundwork for a more organized, comprehensive, and uniform judicial system in colonial India. Thank you for watching. We're thrilled to have you here and hope that you find our content informative, engaging, and entertaining. Be sure to like, share and subscribe and don't forget to join us for further updates.